I'd have to say it was my father that turned me on to the organization. He would bring me to games, and I didn't get to come to many, so it was a really special thing. Right? We had to drive from the other side of town. It felt like we were going to another city to see these games, and I, I will never forget that feeling of walking through the front doors and coming in and the smell of the arena and the sound of the arena, and I didn't want to be anywhere other than in my seat. It's the passion. This is a, a blue collar kind of fan base that just wants to see players go out and give that honest effort and work hard. And then the fans will respond in kind to the effort that they see on the ice. But the passion, I think, is what really sets these fans apart. They're, uh, they're true blue, so to speak. I, I think more than anything, what we see here in Kitchener and what we're so lucky to have in this city is the dedication of the fan base over the generations, really. Many of the season's ticket holders today have been season's ticket holders for decades at this point. Some are original cast, if you want to call them that, from when the team first got here back in the early 1960s. It's just the, it's the tradition, right? We, we call it Friday Nights in Kitchener for a reason. It's been on the calendar in this community for as long as I can remember. This community really looks after its own, and when there is somebody in need, my uncle's a great example of somebody who has his regular season ticket but needs to get a lift to the games, and somebody is always willing to give him that ride. And then if there's a, if there's a rallying cry in a section because the season ticket holders get to know one another, hey, I'm moving on the weekend, hey, we're holding a garage sale, hey, we're doing a fundraiser for my kid, right? They all get around each other just here in the arena, just as season ticket holders. And then you see that expand out into the community because that's exactly the way uh, Kitchener operates as far as I'm concerned. Well, yeah, I, I think I'd go back to the 08 playoff run when we're hosting the Memorial Cup and, and all eyes in junior hockey are on the Kitchener Rangers. And we talk a lot about blowing the roof off the place because of the noise, you could almost blow the roof off of the place before that final versus Spokane because of the, the anticipation. It's like a pressure cooker waiting to explode and, and the fans just couldn't wait to make noise. And I'll tell you, I look forward to the next time we get to hear that in this building because I know we will.